In this video, we will import interior boundary features into our DTM so that we can eliminate triangles inside building pads. If we display the triangles for our original DTM, You can see that the surface is triangulating inside of building pads. What we want is just to have a void in these areas with no triangles at all. In order to do that, we'll need to import these building pads as interior boundary features. To do so, we'll go to File, Import, Surface. We're going to import from graphics into our original surface. We're going to load from a single element. We're going to use element elevations. We'll give it a seed name here. And a feature style. Very important here that we change the point type to interior. We'll use the microstation selection tool to select the two pads and click apply and OK. The import is complete. We'll click close. Now we see we'll turn off the triangles. And when we redisplay them, it is going to ask us to retriangulate. That's because we have changed the triangulation. We'll click yes. And when the triangles are redisplayed, you can see that just as we wanted, there's a void inside our building pads.